All right, today we're about to watch a video. Who is the master of chokeslam? Now I'm old school, so I gotta go with Taker or Kane. Those are my picks. They didn't have some vicious ass chokeslams, man. And I mean, shoot. Yeah, if it weren't for uh, Taker and Kane, I mean, the chokeslam wouldn't even be like a big ass thing. Uh, Big Show, he has some good ones too, but, yeah, and, uh, Hurricane Hems, you know, he has some, uh, Hurricane, he has some, he, he more of a comedy type, man, I mean, he has some good choke slams, but I mean, he ain't nothing like real big, like no sky high choke slam, Braun, he like muscle type, so I mean, shit, he probably got some good choke slams, uh, but yeah, I'm gonna have to go take in Kane, man. Out of both of them, Kane he had, he got the big ass basketball type toe slam. Like he he when he toe slam somebody it actually look like he putting everything into it. So on that side, take I mean uh, Kane shit. I say like man, Kane got the most like I don't know. But then again, Taker like when he his old toe slams where he uh toe slam Triple H and John Cena, his ass had him all the way at the end. He'll hold him up there and he'll bring their ass down. And then walk off like badass man. Like he had, he he even brought them up the highest. I I think out of all of them taking them brought them up the highest. Even with Big Show height, he he'll hold them up there. But I mean Big Show he got the power game advantage. Kane he got the savage choke slam. And Taker he just got the badass choke slam. So I mean shit. Let's see who's the master choke slam. Yeah, Come on, put your hat on. By Ryan Classic. They run Classic. <laughs> and, uh, Psycho Sid. Uh, from what I've seen, him match, his match versus Tony Undertaker, his show fun is not really that good. That was good, that was good. That was alright. could be a choke slam. Jeff Jarrett may be done. Off goes Jeff Jarrett. And down again. Momentum here. Sets on the goal left. That was why you're seeing somebody. That was look why you're seeing somebody choke slam somebody with some underwear on, man. I'm used to people like choke slamming them with them. Like, like fully clothed, man. They got that mask and like kill you type feeling. You know, you toast slam somebody, you want to like imagine they as like, you know, toast slam to hell. They got more masculine, you know, a more beastly like feel to it, you know, toast slam from hell. He's like, he's like he's just throwing them down. Kane, he's straight shoving down, like straight to hell. <laughs> it don't look nothing like that. It looks like it can hurt. It most likely hurt. But it's not hurting like. Look. He's showing his strength off. But. He ain't showing no aggression in it. He ain't putting no aggression in it at all. You got people like Big Show, Kane, Choke Slam motherfuckers to hell through the ring. You got people like Undertaker, Choke Slam people off the cell. Amy loves retweeting Mercy. things online. So when she tried Tostitos hint of jalapeno chips. You got Undertaker, Choke Slam people off the motherfucker stage. Through the cell. Hurricane! Come on, man. Triple H, too big. That was an assist right there. Ain't no way. I know he's gonna do the piece. Rock bottom. Choke slam. Choke slam. Lights 
I miss Jerry, man. He was cool. I don't care anybody say, man. Jerry was cool, man. He went all that green mist hit. I think that was the best one, like so far. You took him up. That was the best one. <laughs> he got some good ones in there, but I mean, it's not like he got to get them up there to his height. And his height is on what? Like five or something. Ooh. Pretty savage. That was some savage on that one. His best one is to the jury. Man, dude wearing his mask. Ooh, we have to pay him back for that. He took his eyes up. <laughs> Hell nah. Fuck you, Ron. I don't want to say that in real life. I had to bring a gun to a fight. I had to bring a gun to fight this big ass. I, I probably wouldn't even fight this nigga with brass nuts. He big as hell. He probably wouldn't even feel that shit going to straight berserker mode. Look at that shit, man. He picked that nigga off the ground, man. Oh, hell no. Nah. Ooh, big as hell. He's bigger than Bob. He's bigger than Kane when he first got to WWE. This dude like that strong. I guess chest to his back is probably like this fucking big. <laughs> big as hell. Why he bigger than that? Is that Simon Dean? I like Jericho. I love their fans, huh? An enraged monster among men. Damn! And, and, and you're, you're right, Corey. Damn! Damn! Like an Damn! Oh, hell no. Nah. They must have... Oh, every time he had the little shit on his shoulder. It looking like, damn, he crashed through the table twice and then break. He cried, he tried to, so, he tried to show slam and fight through, oh hell no. Nah. Fight through the table and they ain't break. Come on, Big Show. Big Show has some good ones. Looking like Paul Bunyan and shit. There's a lot of Paul Bunyan's in the um, WWE now. Everyone rocking a beard and shit, everyone last shit. The ring. I bitch so strong as hell, man. Look at this. Kano with 300 pounds. One arm holding that motherfucker up, man. Damn. I can't barely pick up 300. I don't think I can, man. I definitely can. I can barely even bench press 300 pounds. This motherfucker picking them up with one arm. Holding them there. Damn! This show is strong as fuck. I mean, he slung Ray Mysterio like a fucking baseball bat into the side touch. Until the side, until the, uh, damn man, I forgot the name of the thing, the side post. He slung that motherfucker off of, off of, um, a stretcher, like a baseball bat. That's strength right there, man. I don't give a fuck how good you can box, man. 
You gotta fight this nigga with some weapons, man. Dave versus Goliath, you gotta find a big ass rock or something. Debo, Be Debo versus Craig, find a brick or something. You can't fight this motherfucker. Man. Come on, bro. Still the finisher. Steady getting up and shit, man. They so bring your weight down into it. I hate this new Superman type shit, man. So I'll stay y'all ass down. Woo! Damn. Kane. I remember that. Straight to hell. Come on, Kane. Baseball back. Baseball is there. Mmm. He put his whole weight into that shit, man. Every ounce of energy he had into that motherfucker. Look at this. Mm. Ah. Not only are they getting thrown to the ground, but strength is going to cool it. Now that's why I like King so strong. Look at this. Does that do seem like that? Oh shit. Hold on, hold on. Hello? Man, I'm not talking about shit. Already got bad credit. There you go, Kane. He got him. Referee's called for the bell. There we go. Show him what a choke slam is. Fuck, show him what a choke slam is. Oh shit. I'm gonna take about to kill somebody ass, man. <laughs> take about to kill somebody ass. Even in the beginning, he used to bring his whole weight down on him. Take always been a beast with some choke slam. <clears throat> Watch this. He's about to take his ass up to the tip of his hand. Woo! Boom! To the tip of his hand. Look at that. I like this. Walk off like a badass. <laughs> With the hat on, boy. How did his hat stay on? <laughs> How did his hat stay on? Damn. So the hurricane had it done. Damn. Fuck you talking about, boy? Oh, shit. 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 He like he threw a toy down or something. Mark Lesnar was bouncing all around and shit. Those people you know how to feel from the These people nowadays, I don't know what they do. I don't watch it no more, man. But yeah, man. Like I said, man. Dude must have had. He must have been reading my mind. Because I mean, shit. From, uh. From, uh. The worst to the best. I guess. I guess you would say from the least. The, the less good or whatever to the best, it was in that order. The most, uh, from the weakest to the vicious, the most vicious. I say he had like 
I don't know. I mean, shit. The only the only exceptions I would say, I don't know. Maybe you could switch uh, Psycho Sid with uh, Hurricane Helms. But I mean, Hurricane he did like he screamed when he threw him up on the show. Slam. It might want it. It might not have been that far, but I mean, he showed more viciousness than Psycho Sid. And he was supposed to be a psycho, man, with with the choke slams and shit, man. He was supposed to be a psycho, but he, his choke slam wasn't as vicious as everybody else. Everybody else had some crazy ass choke slams, and his ass, it's like he just, it's like he's just throw him down. He ain't put no type of energy in it, belly at all, like half the time. Yeah, man. And take it, he been choke slam motherfuckers off sales and shit. Pretty much looking like they about to. I, mankind. I heard we got so slam through the ring. I know he when he fell off the cell, when Taker threw him off the cell, he uh his two forever came out or whatever. He got larger than his nose. I don't know how the fuck that happened. Like, your two get your two fall out and you get larger than your nose. I don't know how the fuck that happened. Like it must. I don't know what the fuck. I, it sounds painful. And it looked painful seeing that shit. I ain't know what the fuck that was first. I thought it was some type of tissue they put in his nose to stop the bleeding. But they said it, his tooth was lodged in his nose. And when he uh, got so slammed through the ring, I mean through the cell, the ceiling, uh, I think he broke some bones or something. Ribs, and he was still fighting. They need to make the toughest people, the toughest people in the... Um, the toughest, the toughest wrestlers of all time. They need to make that. So I mean, got some wrestlers that then wrestle through some crazy shit, man. Mankind is literally like Jackie Chan. You know the Jackie Chan of wrestling. And people who don't know who Jackie Chan is, well, everyone knows who Jackie Chan is, but they don't know what Jackie Chan been through in the uh, movie industry, doing all them stunts and shit. Look at this video, man. Jackie Chan was pretty much like that last dude. Not trying to make fun. Well, it was like, he was like that last dude I did a video about, who was uh, high flat, going on top of buildings and doing like life threatening shit, man. That was Jackie Chan, man. And uh, Mick Foley is like Jackie Chan at WWE, man. Even his old videos when he was a kid, they show him doing a lot of crazy shit just like that, but. Yeah, that's my comments, man. This dude in this video, he had everything like lined up the way I pretty much would say it. Yeah, so that's my thoughts on it. He had it pretty good. He had he hit the nail right on the head. Yeah. Peace.